No, this is old camp. And this is not a spring chicken. We're here today out at the Venice Canals. We just this is one of my favorite places to come because it's just so serene. But today <laughs> we're going to be talking about money. Oh well, yeah, you know, as Benjamin Franklin in his Poor Richard's Almanac said, a fool and his money are often parted. Yeah, which gets shown over and over again. A lot of times you always hear from people that tell you advice. They said, if you want to know about, well, actually, if there's, if you want to know about something, go to somebody that knows about it. Yeah, and if you're listening to people on television, you have to remember that most of the people on TV, on the financial channels, are making their money off of things going up, not going down. Well, you could sell it short. Yeah, like no. Down going down. They're wanting to stop the selling short now. They're wanting to put okay. legislation in to prohibit that in our country. They did it in Europe for 30 days, and it basically tanked everything. So They stopped doing it for 30 days? Yeah, and it was a disaster. But, um, you know, like we got, you know, okay, anybody that goes to the grocery store knows there's inflation. Yeah, if you don't know there's inflation, somebody else is doing your shopping. If you go to and, and paying the bills. Yeah, you know, if you buy gas, there's inflation. If you buy clothes, there's inflation. You go to the department store, there's inflation. But according to statistics, we have a negative inflation rate. Ah, is that because the the lowered housing costs are figuring into it? Oh well, yeah, they figure well if you've lost two thirds of the value of your home, then you have no. It drives down the rate of inflation. Unfortunately, that isn't the way it works in the real world. Mm. So, but uh, like everybody knows that uh, everybody is happy and 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 uh, you know, everybody that wants to work is now working. And if you believe that one, yeah, I have a boat to sell you over here. <laughs> yeah, one of these is basically you know, the one that's. Hey, there. actually, but this is good. You actually do see the boat. Yeah, but you, if you bought it, you'd actually know you had it. But then again, you don't actually know it belongs to the people. It's it's not moored. It's just laying against the bank. But. Um, According to the thing, housing values are all up. Yeah, and you see, part of it is, is sometimes when you listen to those, I mean, granted, we listen to a lot more news because that's what we do. We cover news all the time. And so we see where they create the reports and then they redact or change the reports a few days later. Yeah. You may not see that. So you're thinking that everything that you hear on the news is accurate. It's just like everything that has a market research study is true. Yeah. So you always have to look up and see what's behind the figures. Hmm. So if you follow what's been going on is... Okay, can you talk to me? Can you talk to me? 